that is part of the liquid gas inspection. Right. Well, the plumbers install the water heater and they put the vent in as well, so that's all part of their yeah, You can hire anybody in the contract, it says a qualified <laughs> person, so that could right. be a qualified person. <laughs> All right, guys, awesome stuff. I definitely want to make sure that <coughs> the point of this is to expose yourself. Hey, there has been a contract change. Friction. Understand it. Look at it before you write your next contract. Uh, so you've got a pretty good idea of what's happening there. Um, we're going to move here. Title partnerships. Brian, tell me what's going on with title partners. Thanks, John. Um, for those that I haven't personally met, I'm Brian Weiss. I'm with title partners. Um, you're going to notice a few changes here in the next couple of weeks. Fabi, who's been our closer in the office here, uh, her husband has had a change in his job schedule. Going to require her to spend a little more time at home. So Bobby's actually going to go to part time uh, with the company. So uh, uh, well, yeah, we, we wish we could have her all the time. But family comes first, as you all well yeah. know. So I think she just wanted to say a, a quick word. Yeah, I'm going to try not to cry. Well, <laughs> well, it's amazing how life changed, and unfortunately, um, I have to step back. since the beginning of uh, over 10 years ago, so it's not just uh, I mean, she's stepping away from a company that has had a long time relationship with her, so we, can, we wish her nothing, obviously, except the best. Um, in the meantime, on starting Monday, we will have a close with Renee Morris, uh, who's been in the business for 20 plus years, is going to be coming over here, and then we're also bringing another processor in here along with Dawn, uh, uh, Tammy Hodges, so those people who have made comments in the last month or so that we need a third person in here. We've listened and we're going to bring a third person in here to hopefully continue to support uh, your company, uh, your efforts. Um, your business always comes first with us and we want to do whatever we can uh, to support to support that. So um, again, Fabi's is going to be here for the next three days. Feel free to stop by and say hello. But then Tammy is, I'm sorry, Renee is going to be here starting on Monday. So any questions on that? And it was kind of a bomb to everybody. We didn't yeah, get a chance know, to come in. Sorry. Get a chance to come John, so. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. This does give me a chance to, to share something with you guys. Uh, you know, is it cool that if we help our vendors out and uh, make it uh, a seamless closing for your clients? If I offer one small suggestion, and, and let me give you the, some numbers here. Uh, this past month in June, we had 166 transactions uh, scheduled to close in the market center. Guess how many were scheduled to close this past Friday? 30. 20 or 30? 50. 53. Wow. This Friday. This past Friday, right? Last day of the month. Last day of the month. So what, what might I be thinking if I am moving forward writing contracts from today on? I was on the 15th. 17th. 18th. Close on the 19th. Stop closing the final Friday of the month. Everybody's spread extremely thin. This goes for every single vendor. I'm talking down to you know the, the craftsmen getting things done on the inspection notice to everything. Everybody's swamped right now. There's no reason to go ahead and, and apply more pressure by making it the busiest day of the month uh, on a consistent basis. So just by doing that small thing, I think you can make a big difference in, in how you're with your clients. You agree? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Just do it it's daily. just you know, Class, especially the last day of the month Friday because everyone plans yeah. to come back weekend. Obviously, you want to make sure you close this. And it's not just a matter of closing, so you have to make sure everybody gets funded. I close in the middle of the month, Tuesday to Thursday. But are you going to be available for the first Friday? If it is that way, yeah. We have to give them 45 days. We count it wherever it ends up. It doesn't matter. We've had a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. 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 We've had a Monday, Tuesday,